Welcome to another GeoGebra lesson on caption vector equation of line joining two points in two dimensional plane. Please, before we begin, if you have not yet subscribed to our channel, if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, just click the red button to subscribe and also click the notification bell so that whenever we prepare future lessons, they will always get you notified. In this lesson, we will be looking at an activity on the vector equation of a line joining two points activity. Let A and B be two given points with position vectors A equals 3i plus 2j and B equals 4i plus j respectively. Find A, the vector AB, B, the vector equation of a line joining the points A and B. C, a Cartesian equation of a line described by the vector AB. Please, all this lesson, we are going to do it using uh, the GeoGebra interface. So we get the GeoGebra. Okay, we are in GeoGebra, please. The first thing is that we sketch the two vectors, the vector small a and the vector small b. Three i plus two j. So it's represented by the point three two. That's the vector. The vector b equals four i plus j, represented by the point four j, four one. Enter. Good. These are the two vectors. After coming up with the two vectors, we need to identify the points describing the two vectors. The point E describing the first vector is three, two. So we take the point two and click on the point three, two. The point B, four, one. Click on the point B, four, one. So these are the two points A, B, whose position vectors are small a and small b, respectively. With these vectors, we need to get the vector, a says we should get the vector ab, the vector connecting a to b. So in GeoGebra, we just take the vector two and we connect a to b using the vector, and that is the answer u. We look at the coordinates of that vector u, you see that there will be one negative one. So which means that this vector is of magnitude one or magnitude the root of two. Okay. The next thing we need to do is, B says we should find the vector equation of a line joining the points A and B. So we need to find the vector equation. And here in GeoGebra, we are going to see the sense or the illustration of a vector equation in two dimension. And to do that, we know that a vector equation is in the form R equal A, where A is a vector on that line plus a small parameter T, times u, where u is a vector in the direction of that line. So the vector u is in the direction of the line joining this vector a and b. Therefore, we can either choose vector a or vector b to stand for a vector on this line. So if we choose to take the vector a, the vector equation will be in this form, r equals we take that vector a three two plus the small parameter and we we need to first of all set the parameter we set up take our slides and we set our parameter t we set our parameter t yes and we now take the vector R 
to be the vector equation of that line, a point three two, a vector three two plus the parameter t into one comma negative one. Enter. Good. This is the vector equation to know and see clearly this vector, we need to change the coloring. Let us change the color. See, we change that color. We also change the color of the slide. Please, we first of all change this color. Good. We could also change the color of that slide. Okay. Now, how do we describe the vector, that vector equation? How do we describe this vector equation of a line joining these two points A and B? Okay. Look at what we do, please. We take trace and we trace that vector equation using this uh, scalar t, this parameter t. Look, observe keenly, please, and see the replay. Good. You see, that is a trace of the vector equation. That's the trace of the vector equation of a line passing through that. Good. This trace that we have just observed is describing the vector equation of a line joining these two points A and B. Now, C says we should find the Cartesian equation of that line. The Cartesian equation of that line will just be given by simple coordinate geometry which can also be illustrated in GeoGebra as follows. We know that whenever we have two points A and B, the, vec the equation of a line joining those two points A and B is choosing one of the points, finding the gradient, and using that point to come up with the general equation. And in GeoGebra, it is enough for us to just identify the point, and the equation will be in the form y minus if I choose, suppose we choose the point A, we have y minus two, which is the y coordinate of the point A equals, we take our bracket, the gradient is change in y over change in x. We use these two points to get the gradient. And since the two points are three, two, and four, one, y is one, second y is one minus first y, which is, two divided by the next, the second x is four minus the first x, which is x coordinate, which is three into x minus the x coordinates of the point A, which we took and enter. You see clearly the line. That is the line. The line is formed at the end point of the region described by the trace. And please, we can change the color of that line to see clearly which is the line describing that uh, trace of the vector. And please, if we do that, you see clearly you see, this is the straight line passing through the points A and B. So we have come to the end of the brief lesson. If you did enjoy the little animation, please press a like and we would like to hear your comments. Thank you and thank you for viewing.